What's up everyone? I'm the Devastating Just Cause and this is DJC Game Studios. Welcome to the show as always. I am Garth. <laughs> Remember Wayne's World? Okay. You know, that outdated references like that is what why I lose subs. Uh, but we have another episode of oh my DJC's Arcade Corner. DJC's Arcade Corner. DJC's Arcade Corner. DJC's Arcade Corner. Nice Ah, uh, it's like nails in a chalkboard. What they have? What is this? The fifth show, and it just—it started out really nice and now it's just people being tortured why why would you do that to music is what people say about my music so without further uh mr do let's get in today's let's get in today's let's get into today and today's game which is tempest and tempest from atari this is what a lot of collectors absolutely strive to collect um i finally got it it was one of my holy grail games um you know they're not super rare but they're super expensive and they're very collectible uh this is a vector game so that means uh the, every the art is drawn with lines through vector uh, a vector monitor instead of an actual pixel it's a it's like line art um the vector monitors are getting a little more rare, a little more expensive to, to fix these days. Um, I got this at a decent price. Uh, I just counted. I thought it was pretty... Re it's actually, it was over four years ago. Um, and I put some money in to have it all tuned up and, and, and uh, done correctly. And um, it's it's been very good to me. I had a great time playing it for, for, for a long, long time. But literally the last year and a half, um, it just gets moved uh, people don't play it at all because <laughs> most people are not familiar with it. Only I kind of am just from back in the day, um, more or less from uh, recent when you when you visit arcades. I'm not going to get all into it and ramble forever, um, but this is a uh, 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 just a just a unique game. Um, you're basically in a, a, a tunnel going through space, and there's different different tunnels and bases that you have to clear all these. Uh, uh, nasty alien invaders, I guess you could say, and all these red X's. But anyways, you have a super zapper you can use once a level, and you have your weapon, which is basically this. Anyways, you'll see what I mean. Let's stop me babbling and go back to the 80s and play some Tempest. All right, here we go. And this is Tempest. This beautiful machine uh, I'll be parting with very soon. As you can see, just a just a beautiful uh, marquee there. Little little cracking on the bottom, not much. A little little stuff around the edges there. But to be honest, everything as original as it is. Um, few scratches on the side, but that, I mean, you could redo that whole artwork if you want to. Um, you know, it has this, it has this uh, <laughs> bar so people could, couldn't uh, break in. You'd put a padlock on that because people try to pick the lock, you know. Um, but this, you know, it's, it's sad that I'm getting rid of it, but it does not get played as much. Um, you got your... <laughs> Classic Atari buttons there. Let me uh, throw a, a credit on here. And uh, then you see them flashing. <laughs> this just needs to be wiped down a little bit. But other than that, I mean, this there's absolutely no cracking or anything on this. A few little scrapes here, you know, where someone probably keyed it or something in the arcade back in the day. But this is all original. The spinner works perfect. Um, and this monitor, uh, is, is a just beautiful, it's just very beautiful. It's one of my favorite games. Um, but it just doesn't get played anymore. It was what I considered my Holy Grail at the time is now just kind of sitting in the corner by my pinballs. But that being said, let's play my final games of Tempest.
All right, and here we go. Let's do this. Basically got this tunnel in space. All these nasty things are trying to come at you. You just got to keep keep going. super zapper which will blast everything on the screen you can use once which I think I've saved up so oh shoot I could have used it right there <laughs> this vector monitors see there's my super zapper nice. they are uh, I think they just look beautiful I really I really like the art style and vectors Keep them down there. Avoid the spikes. Super Zapper Recharge. Level 5. At the beginning, you could start at a higher level once you start mastering it, but I am by far no master. I'm fair, I'd say. Fair would be the only thing I can really say. I'm not that great. In the higher levels, that you'll the, the vectors change different colors. Darn it, I ran right into him. We might use some super zap around this. And things start getting. Oh shoot! So I still have another credit. I am going to, but this time I'm going to start, let's start on, uh, oh, it's, it's like, go. I started a board ahead, I believe. Or le level three is what I'm at. I started. Super zapper recharge. That way we get right into the action. I will avoid those spikes. It's actually kind of neat. It just breaks apart like glass. Oh, shoot. Go. 
them with the super zapper. Oh man, this plays so good. Oh, I'm gonna miss this game. I just haven't sat down and play, or I haven't played it in a while. I always say sit down. I should say stand up and play. Oh, I hit the spike. Well, you. And there it is. Wow, I had a lot of fun with this. This is. I haven't played it in a while. Um, <laughs> and uh, there it is. Woo! Looks like I'm ranked number four. Well, as I always say, there you have it. But you don't have it. I have it, but not for long. I'm actually getting rid of it. A cool person that I met is coming to buy it. Uh, an arcade collector like myself so it'll go to a good home uh be fully restored the rest of the way i believe he's going to redo some side art uh do some uh, stuff to the woodwork um but it, it's going to go to a good home and it's a great machine and as much as i hate to, to hate to see it go um the money is really going to help me uh pay some bills and do some other things but anyways with that being said what do you think of atari tempest did you have a good time did you Flying through space, flying through V's. Anyways, I appreciate the watch, but make sure if you've been watching me, please like, and most importantly, please subscribe. It costs you not a dime to subscribe, but next time on your, is what I say. Next time you're on YouTube, <laughs> My videos will pop up, so you'll see when I do another Arcade Corner or talk about the Intellivision or the TurboGrafx-16 or maybe the new Intellivision Amico, the controversial s subject right now, which to me is one of the greatest things coming out. But I'm a retro gamer, and that's why I think so. Um, anyways, check that out. Uh, thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you. Gosh darn it all to heck and back is what I... Okay, just I'm just going to stop. Thank you. See ya. See you later. See you in the next one. What is the next one? We'll find out soon. Now I got a friend. Yeehaw. Really? What, a, what is happening on this channel?